time to meet a musical pioneer, Christine McVie now. This is her new single, Red Sun. My mind is filled with journeys Echoed with your smile No, you won't take that away from me Even if you try Sometimes I wonder Do you ever think of me? And it's worse for me at night You know, when the red sun kisses the sea Christine, our back. So the new album in collaboration with Lindsay Buckingham, which Indeed. we'll we'll talk about in a while. But um, we've been talking to Brendan about really living, almost living off grid with as much you know low impact as possible on the mm. environment. And really, that was a, that was a very big part of your life, wasn't it? What living, almost living off grid. Oh yes, absolutely. Yeah. What was it? What was the whole? You know, when you decided to almost stop your music and and live. I decided that kind to of, stop. Did actually, you? Why, yeah. why? Why? I don't know. I had developed a terrible fear of flying to start with, mm -hmm. and I was tired of living out of suitcases and being a nomad. Right. And I wanted to return actually to England because I'd lived in LA for 28 years. Right. right. So I, I needed my roots. So I just moved lock, stock and barrel back to England and I bought this house in Kent, which was a huge manor house, right. which took me like four years to sort of bring oh, back lovely. to its original beauty, you know, mm -hmm. with the beams mm -hmm. and everything. Yeah. And then that was four years gone, the years went and, uh, you know, I think I spiralled down a bit into a bit of isolation. Right. And uh, something just grabbed me one day, I thought, you know, I really miss those guys. They're like my musical family, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, it would it would happen that Mick f was coming to London to do a promo tour for the, the as they were for then. Right, right. And he said, "Come back to Maui with me." He came to London. We flew back to Maui, and I never even felt the, the, the wheels leave the ground. And that was wow. just to get back into the studio, mm -hmm. just to mm -hmm. get back into the swing well, of had, things at and that rest. point, I hadn't really joined the band at that point. It was when I'd gone to Maui and played a mixed little blues band yeah. that I thought, this is fun, mm. you know. Mm. And what would it be like if I was to rejoin the band and mix it? Are you kidding? And, <laughs> of course, they really phoned everybody up and said, yeah, really? come on back. And lyrics and, I mean, as far as the new album is concerned, they're all new songs yeah. on there. So did those lyrics, did they come to you very, very easily? Was it very, you know, was it almost like the good old days, if well, you like? I, I, well, I keep a journal that's full of words, mm -hmm. you know, things that I think of. I, I, I'm a romantic person. I like to write about love, and that's usually my subject. Um, and so I had lyrics stashed away and Ready Lindsay had right. tracks. Not all, I'm saying that he, I think we somehow collaborated in a way. We've always had this musical affinity with each other all through mm. the years. Mm. I, we seem to know what each other's going to play and we jam, we jam well together. But we didn't realise until we got to try these new songs out that we had this, the magic was still there. Yeah, and fans would be delighted to know that there's a tour in mm -hmm. the offing. So can there you tell is. us a bit more about that? Where, when will it be, the Fleetwood Mac tour? Oh, the Fleetwood Mac tour. Yeah. We're going to start rehearsing in March next year and then uh, the tour is around June. Mm. So we're, we're, it'll be global. And is that an exclusive now? Huh? Is that an exclusive? Yes, I we'll think it's safe. Next yes. June. I've only but just heard <laughs> myself, so it is. But that's the interesting thing: is actually the music, the music on the actual album that you've done is actually a lot of the sounds of, of Fleetwood Mac. Well, as it you is. can't really help that because we have John and Mick yeah. on the album, so yeah. it is in essence, except for Stevie. Yeah, yeah. It, the sound will be a bit familiar. Well, it's lovely to have you back, and you're going to be singing "Songbird" for us what nice, with the piano that we've got at the other end of the yes, studio. So we're, that's why we've got more in tonight than usual. I hope I can remember it. Yes. No, well, we'll let you, we'll let you get sorted. While we do, we'll, we'll yes. put another little film, shall we? Huh? That will be going head to head. Better play us out now with a 1977 classic songbird. It's Christine McVie. <laughs> Sean! 
What have you? 